I'm Brian Heron, the Director of Marketing at Freedom Games, and welcome to God Strike, a twin stick bullet hell shooter. You've heard that time is money, but in God Strike, time is your life as well. Today, I'll be playing a quick boss rush on our arcade mode to showcase my favorite skills and to do battle against my favorite enemy. In God Strike, you have up to eight customizable abilities to fit your playstyle, from four active abilities that you can acquire in your arcane codex that cost time as well as souls that you acquire throughout the battle. I prefer Herald Step, a way to dodge when you see a bunch of projectiles coming your way, Arcane Shield, a way to absorb those projectiles, Future Rhythm, a way to increase your DPS when you really need it, and Overload, a way to really increase your DPS when you need it by increasing your bullet spread as well as speed. Additionally, you have the Occult Codex, which gives you four passive abilities that do not cost you time. Here, I really like to increase my movement speed. I really like using Void to bring those souls closer to me when I'm doing battle, so I don't have to go out of my way to pick them up. I enjoy Rapid Fire to have a passive increase to my DPS, and I really love Frostbite, a way that when I am bad and I get hit by a projectile, time is slow, which allows me to get back into a position and maybe do a little bit of extra damage when I've messed up. So now that we have our ability set, let's go and check out one of my favorite bosses in the game, Mobus. In God Strike, you're the Herald of Talal, one of God's final masks. It's an enviable position because you have a bunch of gods trying to kill you because of this fact. Mobus is one of my favorites, a centipede guy with multiple sections that you need to slowly do damage to over the course of his two phases to kill him down. Here you can see I'm kind of dodging around, making sure I'm avoiding all of his big projectiles, gathering souls to power my abilities as I do damage to his segments. A big part of the game is understanding the uh, rhythms of the bosses and their different patterns to know where they're going to come out next so that you can do the most damage and avoid the projectiles. Here I pop it, overload, do a ton of damage to this back segment while dodging some projectiles to get a bunch of damage in. Oh, take some damage there, but as you see, I used time shift to just like frostbite away from the, the damage and get myself out of harm's way while doing a bit of extra DPS. I know he's coming in here, so I prepare myself to do a bunch of damage to a segment that's already destroyed. Have to dig back in and run right into his body and take a bunch of damage, but I'm all right. Dodging around, I still have a fair amount of time left. As you see, as I'm taking damage, I'm not losing health on a health bar, but rather I'm losing time to finish the boss battle. Using our abilities and taking damage all decrease that time. And here in his second phase, I'm here trying to do damage to his back heart, his little tail here while dodging much more projectiles than I was having to dodge in the first phase. Oh, I'll take a bit there, but Frostbite allows me to get back in position, get my bearings before I go back in again. What's really amazing about God Strike is our time mechanic allows us to have some really intense and fun moments. If I run out of health and time, I'm not dead immediately. I just have one more hit I can take before the battle is over. It's very important to be careful. Frostbite there coming in clutch quite again, gathering up shields. Now I have enough to use an overload. I'm going to save it here while I dodge around these mines, avoid the projectiles. And here he comes in here. I'm going to fire up for an overload to get a bunch of damage onto that back tail section, especially there. That was really worth it. Dodging around here, getting out of position, just dodging enough, taking a little bit of damage, but I'm fine. I have about 30 seconds left. Oh no, I didn't want to take damage there. Okay, dodging around quite a bit. I'm in a good spot. Just have to dodge these. Mobus just needs a couple of more attacks. I'm almost out of time though. And oh, as you can see, I'm out of time. One more hit and I'm dead, but I'm just able to get a hit in and finish off Mobus. So thank you so much for watching our gameplay demo of God Strike. Once again, I'm Brian Heron from Freedom Games, and we cannot wait to bring this title to you just next month. Uh, be looking out for us on Steam, and we're really excited to see you in April.